Everything about Case Animatronics Panda version. First, they made this game as an Outlast fan. This is a police station where costumes of the missing animatronics are kept. While in the remade version, we have only three animatronics. Also, developers said that there were more animatronics on deleted version. Our task is to solve the mysterious of mysterious murder. But in the original version, we just have to escape from police station. The second post, photo of loading. But in the their Facebook page, they release a soundtrack of game. The third post, case animatronic panda version will come to Steam green lights. The fourth post, the developers made a YouTube channel where they published short videos of that version. They say these short videos are supposed to be easter eggs in the game, but I was only able to find two of them, and I'm showing them to you. The videos were from when the police station was in PT. Even in some of the new photos, we see a trace of a panda. In this video, we see an unknown animatronic and the cat on warehouse. But in John's room, we see a panda and golden panda, but they removed this easter egg, but they planning to add it on episode 4. More details are on this video. I think we could go outside and I even think we have to go outside the police station to connect the fuse box. Even they made the foreign place of the game. And also this photo is from an area that we didn't see. The trailer is being made. The fifth post is about the tablets. In response to the comments, the developers said that the tablet has other abilities, not just camera monitoring. I think this minigame can be played on a tablet. The sixth post is about the computer case. We use computers to find important information. In the game areas, we see computers that are turned off and don't have cobbles. Only John's computer is on, and Ben's computer and the Archie Room computer. The seventh post, they opened an Instagram page for Panda and no one could find the name of the Panda. I think it is possible to go on Instagram and other programs on John's tablets. Maybe we could go on Insta with computers. The eighth post, picture of the charger, and they referring to the checking the cameras. The ninth post, they invited them to night white, and I think now the old version file is there on. They were going to record a video of people's reaction to this game, but they didn't. Were you there too? If any of you were in that conference, tell about the game in the comments. The terms post fan objects, but people fought with the developers because this game is the clone of FNAF. In response to these comments, developers say that the game is unique. I just want to say that after this video, I don't like FNAF games anymore. Of course, it is my personal opinion. I don't know why Scott deleted this fan game. When several fan games were published without any problems, the developers say that Scott removed it because it was a paid game. The elements post. Some pictures of Night White where nothing can be seen. But in the comments, someone put a link of the FNAF 3 trailer, which is very similar to the case animatronics trailer. The 12th post. There is nothing new, only in this picture we see a poster on the wall that is a picture of a deer and the location of the projector is different. Of course, I show you all posters in the deleted version here. The 13th post. A photo of archive room. I couldn't find any secrets. The 14th post. A photo of the minigame, of course I showed this minigame in this video. The 15th post, where do you think the minigame takes place? I think in John's room. I think we have to complete the, the minigame in the warehouse to unlock this lock. In the second game, they put some devices in old place, like the deleted version and there is a table in warehouse and I think in the deleted version, they put a computer therein. Or maybe there is a mini game in Ben's room to activate the charger. 
or the archive room which now only has a picture of a panda on the monitor. Some say in the warehouse, some people say in the developer studio, but I don't know where it is. Some say in the sewer, and maybe it's an easter egg. The 16th post, here we see a person, and the panda is chasing him. The 17th post, the game was showed in next castle. The trailer will come. The 18th post, they added a temperature object to the game, and I think this mini games is used for that. In remade version, we can just adjust the temperature with a code from a computer in control room. But I think in that version we had to complete the mini game first and then we could control the temperature. The 19th post telling about the release of the trailer and the game and the photo of the panda animatronic. The 20th post the game came in green lights. The 21st post the game has come to the first page of green light because of many positive what someone asked about second parts will be made they said it depends on the players interests what does case stand for c.a.s.e caution animatronics see enemies and more examples is the story of the game like FNAF? I think they completely changed the story in the remade version. And if you look closely at the monitor, there is a clock, but it's never changed. And maybe in the previous version, the time could change. And there was night and day in the game. And I think there were several floors like the mini game. The 20 second pause. The game was ranked 5 out of 1837 by people's votes. If the game's rank gets one vote, it will be released sooner. I think Escort deleted the game out of jealousy. Even in FNAF's new game, we can see that the ability to work has been added and everything look like case animatronic. Still people say this game is a clone of FNAF and some people curse because of the things that Scott say were complied with the developers. But as I said, the developers said that the game was removed only because it was paid. The 23rd post, they say there are no complaints and the game is ranked for probably FNAF fans complained to the game. Probably the developer of Atlas has complained to game because they say this is a fan game of Atlas. In other comments, there is a discussion about a school child and I don't know what this has to do with the topic. Other comments, and they even said that the cat is similar to the character of the game Five Nut at Candy, and developer of FNAF, FNAF can also complain. Fennec. Also, the music in the trailer is copyright and the owner can complain to trailer. Some people request multiplayer. Some people are talking about FNAF 5. The 24th post. Photo of Panda and Cat and a photo of FNAF 2 Freddy. And the developers say that there is no complaint. They changed the cat texture so it doesn't look like candy anymore. They were also a little afraid of stopping the game. People still say that the cat looks like candy and the developers say that we didn't even know about FNAF game. Are there other animatronics? And the response is secrets. The 25th post, the game is ranked third, an explanation of what's in a Steam Greenlight. The 26th post, there are no complaints, the game is ranked third, a video of a panda saying it's an easter egg, I'm really sad about the deletion of that version. Some people say this is a copy of Alien Isolation. Will we see the golden panda in the game? Developers, yes. The 27th post, system requirements. The 28th post, showing the hardcore mode. People say that the game page has been deleted from Steam Greenlight. The 30th post, they prepared an interview and people saying the cameras are copied of FNAF game and you should remove them. And one of the developers named Alex says in this video, the game has no problems and will return to Steam and no one has filled out a complaint form. 
Everything was great when we got an email last night from Scott. The email was non-personal account and wrote about copyright violations. We needed him to tell us what was wrong with the game. We thought that maybe our problems was the texture of the game or the camera. But no one cares about gameplay. We think Panda include copyright. They say the photos are fake and the beer is an updated version of FNAF's beer. Scott Cotton's lawyer has filed a copyright complaint. Talk to people about what monster to add like the park game and people say don't add a squirrel and we won't show a squirrel animatronic. Probably the developer of FNAF hate everything and clearly want to destroy the game. And writing a message to Steam has no effect. When we showed the game in the Russian conferences, they liked it very much. We showed the gameplay in the videos, but people say it's a copy of FNAF. We have to make changes in the game. Developers say them in interview video. The 31st post, they are following up. The 32nd post, the interview on another site, whose video has been deleted. The 33rd post, the developers ask people to come up with ideas for new animatronics and new monsters. Rater is displayed in Easter egg. One of the people say the crocodile and I think the developers are using these ideas for episode 4 and the following episodes. The 34th post they congratulated the new year and gave a release date for the game. The 35th post Scott deleted all the videos on the developers channel even seeing that were not related to Chase Animatronic. The trailer will be released soon. The 36th post, making new animatronics. But because of Scott, they can't make animal-shaped animatronics. Guess who is the first animatronic? And what are his ability? In this photo, these models look like out, but a little different. Some said it was fast. I think the dog animatronic was fast. It looked like a rabbit and can do anything with its eyes. It looked like cartoons dolls mine. And I think that's why they stopped making this model. The 37th post showing the owl. The 38th post showing the dog. They ask question from us. Is it like Foxy in FNAF? The 39th post, new camera interface. The 40th post, change dog to wolf. People say that the characters of the previous version were cooler. You should ask Scott this question. In our opinion, the previous version was not similar to FNAF. The 41st post, removing blood from the tablet and fixing the broken tablet. The 42nd post, showing wolf. Remade of FNAF and Duck and preparing for the release date of the game. Developers don't respond to comments. The 43rd post, the game was approved by Scott. The 44th post, photo of the wolf. The 45th post, new trailer. The 46th post, case animatronic reached the top 100 games. The 47th post, it became a top 30 game. The 48th post, they neared the first 20 people. The 49th post, they came close to the top 10. The 50th post, it was among the top 10 games. The 51st post, they are close to 3. The 52nd post, they released a video of the old version, which seems to be the gameplay of the game, and some people are discussing it, but some people are angry that no news has been released. Maybe the gameplay was from a mini game, and that's why it was not interested for people. I tried to get this video from developers and they didn't give it to me. The 53rd post. After 6 months, the game was confirmed and in the next post, they posted about the remade version and a fan-made 2D version of fan game. But its page has also been deleted. And if you remember, there was different ending in the old version. And in the next few posts, they added a new ending to the game. Also, they changed all voices of dialogues to watch old video with old ending and different dialogues we share watch this video
Also in the new photo of episode 4, they showed the deer animatronic and it's very similar to this version. More complete information in this video.